Welcome to How To Pam. Today I'd like to show you how to install a nifty 2D drafting tool. Uh, 2D drafting is become quite handy in many situations to actually show others a small drawing of what you would like to uh, develop or or uh, have made. Uh, 3D drawing is has its purpose, but more than uh, more often than not, a 2D drawing will be sufficient. And there is an application by the Libri software developers called LibriCAD, and it is very stable and an excellent uh, 2D professional 2D drawing application. So I'd like to show you how to install LibriCAD which is actually this here, LibriCAD. It's open source, but it is a terrific program, and I'd like to show you how to install it on Ubuntu. Now, LibriCAD is not new to Ubuntu. Uh, it's been available through the Ubuntu Software Center since, since Ubuntu version 10.4. However, as with many things in the Ubuntu Software Center, you will notice that LibriCAD the version that's available is quite old. It's 2.02. .02. So we could install it through here, through the Ubuntu Software Center, but we would get the old version and then we would have to add the daily PPA uh, via the terminal window and update and get the, uh, the newer version. So we can actually skip the install if you're satisfied with running the older version, uh, you can get it here at the Ubuntu Software Center. And if you're not satisfied with the older version, you can get it here via the Ubuntu Software Center and then update it. Or we can skip the Ubuntu Software Center and go directly uh, to LibriCAD and get the updated version. Here is for Mac and here is for Windows and here is for our Linux operating system. So let's go there and it will quickly tell us here that we could download the individual packages into a folder and then unzip and install the dev packages or we can simply use apt-get and we can add apt repository repository uh, LibriCAD developer, LibriCAD daily to get the newest version. Uh, the daily is sometimes unstable because it has the very very newest additions to the uh, to the program. Uh, however, to get the newest version that is stable we would add this PPA and then we can update and then we can upgrade and that will uh, that will install for us the uh, the latest version of LibriCAD on our Ubuntu operating system. So let's actually do this. Let's um, let's add. Let's open up our terminal window by pressing Control Alt T, and let's. Let's copy this here. Okay. Right mouse click and let's copy that. And let's paste that into our terminal. Okay, so we're going to add this repository, the daily. We'll press enter. It wants a password. Okay, it's adding that repository. It says to press enter if we're satisfied and yes we will. Okay, now the next step here it's telling us that we need to run an update now. So we could copy and paste this or we can just quickly write And we'll update.
and that will update all the accessible PPAs so that when we run the next command the system will be sure to check all of the updated PPA addresses to get the latest software for us. Now we do not I, I keep the Ubuntu system up to date regularly so I do not want to sudo add app get update and then upgrade every piece of software on the system so what we'll do after it's done updating is we will just add it ask it to install to install LibriCAD for us okay there it's done updating so instead of saying sudo app get update upgrade and upgrading all the software we will run this command we will install LibriCAD and we'll say yes and it will fetch the LibriCAD software for us and install it you can see here it's telling us that it's going to fetch 10.6 megabytes of archive files okay it's already done that that was quite quick now it's unpacking unpacking and installing processing the triggers and there we go okay we should be satisfactory let's just exit our terminal window let's get rid of this and let's just type in the window here LibriCAD and there we are there so let's click on it to open it up it's telling us how would we like to start in the millimeter I think we'll use inches here English and English okay there you go now that opened up quite quickly what I would like to do I would like to check the help here and see about And see what we have here this was released on October 4th of 215 so you can see that we have quite a recent version okay we can close that out I'm an idiot. And we will have a look in development here. No education. No. Let's go to office. It 
it's under graphic programs okay so LibriCAD installed under graphic programs and I will show you in some upcoming tutorials how to use this it's actually quite easy once you've got it installed you can play around with it a little bit and we will run some tutorials to show you how to get started with this terrific program okay thank you for watching another how-to PAM tutorial